Twitch play makes you say, 2K TV Wow! Pick that one right now! And if you send in your best plays using the hashtag 2K. 2K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA. Up next, the Grizzlies take it on the Lakers. For Memphis, tough road loss in game one, but they still have a chance to break serve here. Lakers, Grizzlies, the Western Conference Finals is up next. Welcome to the NBA playoffs on 2K Sports. The fight for dominance in the West continues tonight. It's game two of the conference finals. This is Brian Anderson, joined courtside by Grant Hill and Clark Kellogg. Our reporter tonight, Ali LaForce. And checking out the opening lineup for Memphis. Jackson Jr. and Adams guard the paint together. Moran and Bain in the backcourt together. And it's Robbie in at the three. And for the Lakers, LeBron and Davis, the two stars for L.A. on the floor. They're the three and the five. D'Lo and Reeves are the backcourt duo. And it's Vanderbilt in at the four-man spot. You take a look at the Lakers. And with a win in game one, they have an opportunity to put the hammer down tonight. And this would be a big step toward the finals. To take a 2-0 lead tonight with two more games left on their home court would put them in terrific position. Now here's Bain. Pass to Robbie. at six. Adams, the pass to Moran. And the foul is called. He missed it, so he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. It's going to be on Anthony Davis. The boundless athleticism Moran has is really special. He's someone that is always in attack. Free throw is good. And Morant drops them both. Here are the Lakers with the ball. And here's Russell. Shoots over Moran. The shot by Russell, no good. Good contest. Can't let them have open shots from mid-range. Payne against Davis. Payne, the pass to Adams. From the right block. And he tries it off the glass, but it's no good. Pass to Russell. About a minute played here so far in the first. Davis down low. Adams covered. And that was good. Davis. AD just shoving past the inside contact that time. Powerful move getting it done. Moran pass to Adams. Pass to Bain. Drives to the hoop. And he buries his first look. Somebody that's really comfortable carrying the offense to blow. And Russell's got the ball here for Los Angeles. It's hauled in by John Moran. And about two minutes into the first quarter here. Vanderbilt pulls it in. Tell you what, guys, you don't see that often. I mean, when he's this open, usually it's lights out. Saw his teammate with a pass to the rim, and boom, lobbed it up there beautifully. Very smooth catch and finish. And he chose the conservative finish with a nice, easy layup, which was a good decision. Outside Davis, pass to James.
Davis down low. Nice put back on that follow from Davis. Was just determined to get that rebound. And so Moran will bring it up to the Grizzlies. Trailing by two. Partner. His energy level is ramped up. I think he's been terrific right from the opening tip. Personal foul. First team foul. At the line for the Lakers, Anthony Davis. That free throw, good from Davis. And you know, for big man, Anthony Davis has always been above average at the free throw line. Timeout call, the Grizzlies. Welcome to the floor, the legendary, fantastic legendary. And during the postseason, let's see who's been working the hardest on the glass. Second is Anthony Davis. His awareness around the rim has really been impressive lately. It's obvious he knows every possession is important in the playoffs. Here's Robbie. Outside Moran. Pass to Bain. Six on the shot clock. Memphis needs to get off a shot. Here's Jackson. Percentage. Yep, that one's good. Their ball moving on this run has been tremendous. It's led to a lot of good, clean, open looks. Pass to Jackson. Three pointer. And another miss by Memphis. The Lakers in the lead. Outside Vanderbilt. James deciding where to go with it. to go. That makes him two for three in this game. We've seen that more than once today. An effortless basket inside. Well, listless and lifeless at the defensive end. I mean, especially inside. They really got to pick up that interior defense. Now here's Bain. And he drops that one in. Bain's got his second basket of the game. Pick works well there, but the defense left a lot to be desired. Yeah, that's not the defense you need. You gotta be tougher defensively. Left side, Davis. Over Adams. And Davis with the basket. Obvious. Just by Vanderbilt. Davis has got 11. And why go away from attacking inside if the D has no answer for you? Moran, the pass to Robbie. Jackson outside. Adams finds Bain. There's the triple. Drills it from deep. He's got seven. Don't want to let him get into a rhythm from out there. Reed, pass to Davis. Back to Reeves. Who walked away? Russell against Moran. Down low. Here's James. Just add that one to the highlight reel, James. is true. One of the greatest slam dunkers of all time. Pass to Bain. He got it. Four for four now. He's automatic. He's been perfect this quarter. They keep feeding him, and he keeps delivering. To the paint. Here's Russell. Uses the glass on the layup. That's not the kind of streak you want to be part of. 
Memphis has gone one or two from three-point land so far. Memphis calls timeout. Protecting the rim has to be their top objective right now. Yeah, you know, just look at the numbers, guys. I mean, they are being taken to the woodshed in the paint. All right, fans, who wants a T-shirt? The Lakers making a switch here. Wright's checked in. Tillman's checked in for Memphis. Smart comes in for Roddy. takes a lot of pride in shot blocking and defending. He's no slouch at that end of the floor. And the call will be against Jaron Jackson. That's his first foul of the game. Christian Wood is checked in for Los Angeles. Reddish comes in for Russell. And Memphis also making a switch. Miles Bridges checked in for Moran. Pass to Reddish. Shot clock at six from the top of the key, and it's Tillman with a rebound. Memphis trailing here. It's Payne. Ooh, he took a hard foul on the shot, so he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. Second team. Shooting for Memphis. Desmond Payne. Taking two shots. Checked in for Los Angeles. And Memphis also making a switch. Gennard's checked in. That's also good. So he hits both free throws. Free throw shooting is about mechanics confidence and your mental approach he's locked in from there most every night here's right and he can't get that one great d that time from Bain. memphis has gone one or two from three-point land so far Kennard finds bain here's the three hey in six attempts he's made five talk about efficiency could have been much better defense i mean you can't Give this guy any room to operate. Right outside. James up top. And James throws it down. Nice floor awareness that time from right. Spots the gap and then finds the open man. Kennard passes to Bain. Smart outside. Pass to Bridges. A three point Laker lead. A great decision from Smart. He's all about doing what's best for the team. And there's James from the arc. It's rebounded by Memphis. Boy, they dodged one there, guys. I mean, he got the wide open look that he wanted, just did not get down. It's Bain. And the layup is good off the glass. Bain 
Embiid's got 16 points. He's clearly on the attack, making six of his last seven. Right against Smart. Right pass to Reddish. Up and over Kennard. Reddish misses. Well, you know he wants that one back. I mean, more often than not, he'll sink that mid-range jump. Could give him the lead. Joseph has checked in for James. And that one drops. So now they lead by one. Los Angeles has gone one or two from three-point land so far. Two minutes. Right, drives it. And the shot goes down. Right, able to take on physical defense and power through it. Excellent balance that time. Clark is checked in from Memphis. second bucket on the night and that's exactly how you attack length i love how he doesn't lack assertiveness that's well done there i mean don't even give him a chance to get to the block get in tight and finish at the rim here's joseph back to right five to shoot here's reddish and it's blocked by clark and they're able to recover and the basket by wood 36 seconds left to play in the first. Right against Smart. Rebounded by the Lakers. Right outside. Nice. Gets his second bucket. He's due for four now. They're finding ways to get the ball into the paint. Five consecutive buckets. And on the flip side, the defenders have to show more fun on the interior. They've got all for more resistance here. Fast break. Here come the Lakers. And he's going for the lob. Out of bounds. It'll be Grizzlies ball. Unforced turnovers. They'll drive your coach insane. Now smart. Three-pointer for Bridges. Oh, it would have counted had it fallen. But it is offline. Well, we've seen some great shots in the first quarter. No shortage of offense. Lakers on top, they lead by six. And we'll be back in just a minute with the start of the second quarter.
to have you with us as we return to the action here in the Western Conference Finals. Let's get a quick check of the scoring breakdown here for the Lakers. Well, great play down low. I mean, you expect the defense to adjust, collapse maybe, but that should open up things on the perimeter later in the game. Another big component of their game early on has been their execution on the fast break. They're getting a bunch of easy baskets, pushing it in transition. On the court right now for the Grizzlies. Moran and Smart in the backcourt. Jackson Jr. and Adams guard the paint together. And it's Roddy in the three slot. Wow, Davis on fire right now. Doing just about anything he wants on offense. Here's Smart. The Lakers getting their last shot to go. Roddy, no good. Oh, love the intensity which they're hitting the board. Guys, that's been the key to their lead. I mean, simply put, the effort they've displayed on the glass has been the difference. Launches it. Rebounded by the Lakers. The shooter thought he had enough space, but the defender was right on him. You know, that's a trademark of his defense. Quick to react, close down the shooter, and then affect the shot. Now here's Reddish. Got a piece of it. Second chance shot. And that one's long. Memphis has gone three of six from deep so far. Here's Moran. Into the lane. And then Moran with the dunks. The quick feed to Moran. He's so dangerous when he's cutting to the rim. Outside Russell. And again, the Lakers, no good. For Memphis, they've gone to just one of three to begin the second quarter. And here in the second with about a minute and a half gone by. Adam, shot's good. The commitment and focus. I mean, Adams doesn't let a little contact distract him from his end goal. Russell, the pass to Vanderbilt. Back to Russell. To the middle. Here's Reeves. And so he draws the foul. And into the line to shoot a pair. And even from where we're sitting, you could clearly tell it was a foul. No question about it. I mean, a ton of contact. And a good call by the official. Austin Reeves. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. First free throw is good. The Lakers making a switch here. James is checked in. So he got them both. And it's Moran with the ball for the Grizzlies. Six-point game. Pass to Jackson to the inside. That's good from Adams. On the assist by Jackson. Adams has got his second basket of the night. This is where Adams looks to score, especially when he has a matchup he likes. Oh, the swap by Adams. Here's Ronnie. That one misses. Desmond Bain. He's checked in for Smart. And he sinks the second. And a little under two and a half minutes gone by here in the second quarter. Pass to Reeves. Back to James. Takes a three. The rebound by Jackson. The Grizzlies have gone three of five since the beginning of the second. Here's Bain. He gets it. He's seven for eight and really going bad about there. The way Morant sets up his teammates is as good as any guard in this league. 
Here's Reeves. Guarded by Bain. Shot is good by Reeves. Reeves has got four points in the quarter. The Grizzlies have gone four for six here in the second. Brand pass to Robbie. Here's Adams. Outside Bain. Here in the second quarter, just under three and a half minutes to play. The shot by Reeves, no good. Yeah, he just flat out tricked that one, missed it, and has no one to blame but himself. Moran, Moran with the slam! Oh, putting on a show for the fans. Moran's skills making it look like a circus in here. Here's Reeves, guarded by Bain. A three, James. Oh, LeBron buries a three. Just make sure you keep getting him touches. I mean, you love what he's doing at the offensive end. Don't go away from him. Here's Moran. Russell with the rebound. It's one thing to prevent the layup. It's another to do it without fouling. Just terrific defense. And it's out of bounds. They say it was last touch by Jackson. Timeout called. The Lakers. Call for the Lakers. Welcome to the floor, the legendary, fantastic Lakers. And looking at these playoffs so far, here are some of the players who have been distributing the ball the best. Fifth on the list, Ja Moran. I really admire how he seeks out his teammates. His selfless attitude and desire to get his guys going is what makes him such a valuable player. James, outside. For three, Adams grabs the miss. It's tough to get open in this league, and when you do, it hurts not to capitalize. Here's Robbie, checked by James. Floats one, and Robbie, Robbie gets it to go. Gotta fight harder to get over those screens. Well, I'm gonna credit the screen. I mean, that's a good, strong pick he lays there. Oh, it's blocked by Jackson. The attention to detail on defense. Jackson reads shooters well and knows when to call for blocks. Stolen by Davis. And finished off by Davis. Oh, that's impactful defense right there. Finding a steal and instantly turning it into offense. Pass to Jackson. That one falls. He's now one for three. Yeah, that's how Jackson's most effective, playing aggressive around the basket. Here's Reeves, knocked away, and out of bounds. The Grizzlies will take it. And here's Jackson, he'll bring it up for the Grizzlies. Trailing by two, knocks it loose, stolen by Russell. Let's it go from 11. Oh, it's blocked by Jackson. Over to the left wing. Stolen by Vanderbilt. Inside. Now the Lakers moving it up. Davis. That's good. Anthony Davis understands the value of points in transition. Getting out and finishing on the break. Oh, Moran going right at him. You know, the second period's been much more kind to him than the first. I mean, let's see if he can keep it going and maintain this. James inside. No good there. Off the double clutch. For Memphis, they've gotten 8 of 12 attempts to drop since the beginning of the second. Oh, Moran gets it done inside. Yes. I mean, just an agile move by Moran down low. Working around the contact and getting it to go. And the Lakers call time here. And as we head into this break, the players have an opportunity to replenish their energy with Gatorade as they prepare to go into the final stages of this ballgame. Absolutely. Over the course of a game, not to mention over the course of a season, you have to stay hydrated. If you don't, it's amazing how much slower your body is to bounce back. 
It can have a serious effect on performance, no question. And some changes here for the Lakers. Christian Wood is checked in for Vanderbilt. Joseph comes in for Reeves. And Wright subbed in for Russell. Oh, it's blocked by Jackson. Here's Bridges. James with the block. And they'll keep possession. Here's Tillman. That infinite wingspan of Davis is on full display there. Here's Wright. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. Wright's got seven. Defense left him just a little window to get through, and he just ducked in for the layup. Terrific job. Kennard passes to Jackson, and stolen by Wood. Back to Joseph. Oh, it's blocked by Jackson. Here's Bridges. Yes, and a nice assist from Jackson. Setting each other up beautifully. I love it. Eight of their last ten points coming off assists. You know, nothing makes a coach happier than selflessness on the basketball court. Now, here is James. He's got 11. That's his second triple this quarter. I guess he's left that dry spell behind. Kennard outside. Let's it fly. With the rebound. Los Angeles has gone two of four from the perimeter in the second so far. Joseph traps in the layup for two. And now it's a five point Los Angeles lead. LeBron doing what he does best creating four and elevating others. Miranda gets right. Now here's Bridges. The ball's knocked loose. Davis. Nice persistence to tip it back in. Davis has got 19 points. Memphis has gone 3 of 6 from deep so far. Here's a floater. That's Morant missing. And for Los Angeles, they're shooting just around 39% in the second quarter. Wood finds right. Bridges against James. To right. Just five on the clock. The Lakers got to get one up. Late clock. And it's going to be a 24 second violation. They turn it over. Hayes is checked in for Los Angeles. Smart's checked in for Memphis. Memphis trailing here. Bridges is outside. Shot to stop the run. It's Hayes with the rebound. And for Los Angeles, they're shooting around 51%. That's a good number. Here's Joseph. And it falls. Two for three from the field so far. Trickery on display. I love it. Sometimes Joseph is unguardable when he goes to his sweet floater. A shot a little guy has to have. Here's Tillman. Bridges outside. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. Second team. Shooting from the first. Miles Bridges. At the line for two. good from Bridges. You know, one of the things that endeared Miles Bridges to his college coach was he was a superstar in talent but played with a blue-collar mindset. Reddish has checked in for James. Clark has checked in for Memphis. <laughs> Off on that one. So he goes one out of two at the line. And it's Wood with the ball for the Lakers. Here's Joseph. Pass to Wood. And Wood with 
with the stuff. You can really feel the momentum swinging in their direction. And, you know, they need to stay aggressive here. Build the lead up while they've got the chance. Don't waste this opportunity. Now here's Smart. Still without a bucket. The assist. The assist from Smart has got his fourth assist with that last one. And they had early success from the perimeter, but I don't understand how they've gotten away from that here in the second. And, and trailing in this game now is not the time to start playing conservative. I mean, if you've got an open look from deep, let it go. I mean, you've got to play freely and with confidence. Right, the pass to Wood. Over Clark. Wood misses. Memphis has gone 0 for 2 from outside in the second quarter. Pass to Tillman. Now smart. Kennard outside. It's deflected. Well, he's got such length at 6-5 in the backcourt. Perhaps surprised the shooter there and came up with the block. The Lakers in the lead. About seven seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Pass to Hayes. Reddish with it. Back to Hayes. To the right side. Just four to shoot. Pulls up. Joseph can't hit. Bridges outside. Oh, he beats the buzzer just in time. Wow, big time bucket, I'll tell you. Great clock management there. An ideal way to end the quarter with momentum on your side. And so it's Anthony Davis making things happen for Los Angeles. Eight points in the quarter, showing how effective he can be. All right, we'll get back to the action after this break. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. And a heightened atmosphere we have here this evening for NBA playoff action. Hey, everybody, I'm Ernie Johnson. Got Shaquille O'Neal and Kenny the Jet Smith by my side. Taking a look at the Lakers, getting out to a 2-0 lead in the series would mean so much to them. And it looks like this game could go down to the wire trying to achieve that goal. This game is definitely still up for grabs, the way these two teams are battling. What did you think, Kenny, about what we saw from the Lakers? We have to love the second unit. I mean, after Davis plays, they're doing much more than giving the starters a break. We're seeing real intensity from them, particularly on the offensive end. And over to the big fella. Your thoughts on the Grizzlies' first half? Uh, they can't be happy with the defense. I don't know what 50% shooting. They need to be a lot more aggressive at that end of the floor. Get those hands up, move your feet. Do the early shuffle. Bop, bop, bop. The early shuffle. Bop, bop, bop. And that wraps up the halftime show. Third quarter is set to begin in just a few. And let's get you back to the action as game two is getting underway. Well, you got to like what we're seeing from Desmond Bain. You just love his patience offensively in the first half. Waited until he got the looks he wanted. You know what, guys? It was all about efficient offense, not rushing things. Taking your time, finding the best shot on every possession. And in that first half, we saw a pretty tight battle. We'll soon find out what sort of adjustments were discussed during halftime. Vanderbilt at power forward with Davis in the middle. Reeves and LeBron fill out the perimeter. And it's Russell in at the point. That's the Laker five. Pass to Moran. Good work defensively by Russell. He did everything in his power to make that a hard shot. And you know what, guys? That will pump him up because he takes a ton of pride in what he does on defense. The lead score demonstrating once again how fast he can fill it up. And it's Grizzlies with ball. After the Lakers picking up a basket just moments ago. Body, no good. Good offense beats good defense? Not always. Pass to James. 
from James now for what? Two decades? Smart with the ball. To the middle. Tillman in the post. Davis on. for Moran over Russell the Lakers with a rebound Davis has got his fifth rebound of this one clearly out of sync to begin this half all for their first three attempts James with the ball 18 points for him they get it back you gotta move past that one I mean they want to take that again well you know I hear you that's a good look but when you're that wide open I think you got to knock it down. Now here's Moran. Up and over Russell. Misses off the right iron. Oh man, what happened at halftime? Since then, they're 0 for 4. And it goes. As the official calls the foul. Count it, and he'll shoot one more at the line. And the Grizzlies with some changes. Adams comes in for Tillman. And it's Desmond Bain in for Smart. Is good from Russell. Guys, it's always good to see a young player start to mature in front of our eyes. And Russell has been that kind of guy. He's done a great job figuring out how to become a better leader. Now here's Bain. Give him 20. And here's Adams. Here's Roddy. And another miss by Memphis. And Davis has got the ball here for the Lakers. 12-point lead, their biggest of the game. And so it looks like the Lakers will retain possession here. Second half of play here with just under two and a half minutes passed. Outside Russell. Oh, there's the alley! Davis slams it home. There's no stopping that. AD is too long and strong to bother that alley. Pass to Robbie. Third quarter here, and three minutes have come off the clock. Here's Bain. And how about that? Eight for nine now. That's where they'd like all their shots to come from. The Lakers have gone four of six from the floor in this third quarter. Wing, Reeves, guarded by Bain, lets it go from 14. The shot by Reeves, no good. For Memphis, they've gone only one for six here in the second half. Rejected by James. He's been ice cold tonight. You know, you look at the scoreboard guys, they really could have used this contribution. And adds a few more points to their lead, showing off some style. Wow, that was prime time stuff right there. Guys, it is symbolic of their effort here tonight. Now here's Moran. Got 10. There's Bain. Driving in. Got a piece of it. Here's James. Well timed pass. And he goes straight to the bucket for the layup. James has got six in the quarter. Outside Moran. Three pointer. And again, Memphis no good. quarter like this, the only beneficiary is the defense. They're really dictating the tempo on both ends of the court. Love it. And don't leave out the coaching staff here now. I mean, their game plan has been perfect. Now here's Bain. 22 points for him. Jackson finds Adams. Here's Robbie. Check by James. Five on the clock. That one rolls around and rims out. He's giving his all, but you can't force yourself back on track. Pass to Reeves. Now James. The basket drops, and he gets fouled on the shot. One free throw coming his way. That is the savvy of LeBron on display. Doesn't just convert, but draws the foul and has
has the chance to attack another one on this point total. And a moment now to quickly take a look at the offensive approach for the Lakers. They feel like they have an advantage inside, and so far they have done an excellent job exploiting it. And the thing I've seen that I've really been impressed by is they've gotten everybody involved, unselfishly making that extra pass, getting that ball to the right guy at the right time for the good shot. Now a timeout called by Memphis. You gotta like what we're seeing from LeBron James. He's been on a mission, attacking the basket all game long. I'm curious to see what adjustments they can make. And here now, a list of the players who have had the hottest hand in the playoffs. Second is Ja Morant. Perfect time to take it to another level offensively. He's really carried them at that end. Memphis has gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the third. Pass to Roddy. Hope loose. Stolen by Russell. To the inside. He blocks it again. Oh, you can't throw the weak sauce around him. No, you can't, B.A. I mean, he's sending everything back. Now here's Jackson. And there's a whistle. That's going to go on Jared Vanderbilt. That's his first foul of the game. Jackson on the wing. Oh, they get a hand on it. And it's out of bounds. They say it was last touch by James. He clipped the ball there, but not enough to nab the steal. Clearly a careless pass. He got away with one there. Russell against Moran. Just five to shoot. Down low. Adams, shot's good. Adams has got six. Well, Adams is as crafty as he is big. When he's right under the rim, good coverage just doesn't cut it. Here's Russell. Blanketed by the D. He fights to the rim for the layup. And they keep on figuring out ways to force the rocket inside and convert. Pretty clear. It's smash mouth basketball. Pound that thing inside. Now here's Moran. Ten points for him. Jackson, the pass to Adams. Good. Excellent D there from Davis. Pass to Reeves. Lays it up and banks it in. Six points for him. And just not letting up at all. I mean, you have to love this approach. You want to get the ball to the guys who make plays. If it's working, keep working it. That's what I say. Keep the pressure on. Now here's Adams. He's got six. Off the mark with the outside fadeaway. <laughs> I'll tell you what, they've rebounded the ball tremendously well. Yeah, you look across the board, it's actually sizing up, shaping up to be a great game. I mean, strong performances throughout, and they've really been strong on the glass. And he gets it to go. Payne's got four points this quarter. He's trying to will this team back into it, doing all he can offensively. Well, time called here. Los Angeles decides to talk it over. Yeah, coach no doubt wants to use this timeout to review the matchups and maybe make some adjustments as well. And I agree. I think there's going to be a new wrinkle in their game plan when they come out of this timeout. Some changes now for the Lakers. Woods checked in for Vanderbilt. Reddish comes in for Reeves. And Wright subbed in for Russell. Clark is checked in for Memphis. Miles Bridges comes in for Robbie. Now here's Wright. He's got seven. Wood left side. Shoots over Jackson. And again, the Lakers, no good. Fadeaway was the right shot there because he got his attempt away from the defender. But the touch was poor. And this guy, to me, embodies determination. Small in his position, but he still gets up and keeps plays alive. That's mind over matter for sure. Davis finds right. Back to Davis. And Clark with a block. Bridges against James. 11 feet out. Rejected by James. And he recovers it. Bridges misses. Feels to me like this team is going to need more from him, guys. I mean, if they're to erase this deficit, he's got to step up. Davis, the pass to James. Now here's Wood. 
outside Reddish. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. Jaron Jackson picks one up. The officials were right on top of that one. Clearly a foul. I mean, didn't give him any choice but to blow the whistle. I mean, you got to play without foul. And he knocks down the first one. Joseph is checked in for LeBron. Kennard, he's checked in for Memphis. Smart comes in for Moran. Both good from the line that time. And really strong at the line since the break. No misses yet. Can't do much better than that, guys. Outside Bain. Clark left side. Kennard outside. From deep, Bain. Rebound collected by Anthony Davis. Davis has got nine rebounds in the game. Boy, he's getting it done. And Reddish gets it to go. <laughs> They're not messing around. Five of their last six buckets have come from the interior. Memphis has got nothing to fall from outside in this third quarter. Clark outside. Pass to Smart. Outside Bain. It's stolen. To the paint. Here's Davis. Another shot. And he takes it up and lays it in. Davis has got 25 points. And they're plus five on the boys after that rebound. Tipped away. Right with a steal. Pass to Davis. And Davis slams it home. Yes, sir. A D. Threw it down easily. Smart looking around. Two Outside Bain. In the third. Two minutes. We've got 155 left in the third. Clark, the pass to Bridges. Shot clock at five. Kennard outside. Will it go? That's tipped. Tries to keep it alive. Out and out of bounds. Los Angeles will have it. And the Lakers making a change here. Hayes is checked in. And Memphis also making a switch. Tillman's checked in for Desmond Bain. Right, the pass to Joseph. It's good. Corey Joseph. Joseph has got six points. They've been a little soft with their defense on the interior. Yeah, and they're really getting pummeled on points in the paint here. Timeout called the Grizzlies. You can see the coach very displeased with their defensive effort on the glass. They're giving up a bunch of second chance points. They got to get that correct. It's time, everyone. Let's hear it for your Laker girl. We've got 123 left in the third quarter. Oh, they get a hand on it. Right with a steal. Over smart. And it's right missing. And just not allowing the shooter to get comfortable from mid-range. As a defender, he's going to just be a bothersome, worrisome guy. Making you miserable all night. A hand in your face on every jump. Out of bounds. Really? Memphis keeps oh. possession. Here's Kennard. Pass to Bridges. Four on the clock. Clark outside. To stop the drought. Boy, excellent coverage that time by Wood. His length and speed make him hard to get around. Here's Wright. 
And there's a whistle. He'll head to the line to shoot two. They'll pin that one on Marcus Smart. Everyone in the building saw the obvious contact. Yeah, the officials didn't need to talk that one over. It was obvious. For the Lakers, DeLon Wright, two shots. And he makes a first. And he makes both free throws. Now smart. No made baskets yet. Here's Tillman. Pass to Kennard. The floater. Wood grabs the board. They really have a commanding lead, not just in points, but in rebounds as well. And what I like about it, it's been a physical brand of basketball. It's had a little sandpaper element to it. Gritty and rough, but that's how you win games. And with a big lead, it's easy to take your foot off the gas like they did there. We've got 13 seconds left in the third. Bridges outside. Pass to Smart. Over right. Got a hand on it. And so it's Anthony Davis making things happen for Los Angeles. 27 on the night. He's had it his way. We'll be right back. The Grizzlies. 62. And as we head into the fourth, we'll see if there's a comeback in the works or if it's more of the same for the first three quarters. Memphis shooting only 38% from the floor. Not great. On the court for Memphis to start the fourth. Luke Kennard out there with Derrick Rose. Then it's Brandon Clark. Then it's Miles Bridges. And it's Tillman in at the five. That one falls. Miles well, I tell you what, it's obvious Bridges takes great pride in working through contact and capitalizing. Right outside. Pass to Hayes. It's Prince on the wing. Here's Joseph. The shot, no good. Good D by Rose. Stripped away. And that one's good. Joseph. Lay off Joseph too much, and he has no problem taking these shots. Excellent at catching and shooting. The ball's knocked loose. Right with a steal. To the inside. And that one's good. Joseph. And the defense has no one to blame but themselves. I mean, they just let him get right to the rim. You know, he should be getting extra attention from the defense, not less. Now here's Kennard. Here's Tillman. Pass to Rose. Six to shoot. Over right. Rose can't connect. And so Prince will bring it up for Los Angeles. And stolen by Clark. Kennard outside. Played it in with a nice touch off the window. Los Angeles has gone four of nine so far from the perimeter. Rose against right, inside. Hayes inside. It's blocked! It's stolen away! The three ball! And that one's good. Joseph. Joseph has got nine points here in the second half. Yeah, he can be lethal from distance. When Joseph has room to fire, 
He's not going to hesitate. Bridges down low. Reddish covering. No good with a layup. Los Angeles has gone 5 of 10 from beyond the three-point line in this game. Here's Joseph, defended by Kennard, and that one's good. Joseph. This is a fantastic performance in this half. He didn't play as well in the first, but you know, you just know with this guy, he's always ready to turn it around. Now here's Kennard. Tipped away. Rose finds Clark. With the teardrop. And the layup is up and in. Rose, a very solid floor general. I think that's an underrated part of his game. He's excellent at finding his teammates. Rose against right. Pass to Hayes. And here's Reddish. Down to five on the shot clock. Nice D from Bridges. I've been in this position. Your team is up. You want to drive in the dagger. He may be a little overeager. And the basket by Clark. Fourth quarter of play, and over three and a half minutes have gone by now. Joseph passes to Hayes. Back to Joseph. Shot's blocked, and they recover it. Pass to Prince. Fires for three. And the Lakers hit again from deep. Yeah, you know, Prince is always doing a nice job working to get open. And that's the reward you get for staying active, keeping yourself moving. An open look on the jump shot there. Now here's Kennard. Bridges outside. Clock at six. Now the Lakers moving it up. Here's Joseph. And the Lakers tack on two more. The defense had him confused early on, but he's responded in the second half with some assertive play. Rose outside. And he gets the bucket. He have no answer defensively inside. Yeah, and that's four straight field goals now they've allowed from point blank range. Can't happen. Now here's right. Pass to Hayes. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. That's his first personal foul. First team foul. At the line for the Lakers, Jackson Hayes. Can't get the first one. And the Lakers with some changes. Vanderbilt comes in for Prince. And Reeves is subbed in for Wright. Second free throw. No good. The Grizzlies have gotten five of their seven shots to fall in this final quarter. And that'll be Memphis's ball as it goes out of bounds. Grizzlies able to keep possession here. Here's Morant. Well, you know, their shooting is not where they want it to be here in the second half or where it needs to be, especially if they want to chase down that lead. And that one's good. Joseph. Well, what a quarter for him. I mean, he's found his rhythm, and he's really riding that wave right now. Kennard outside. Pass to Adams. Over Hayes. And it's Adams missing. Los Angeles has gone two of two from outside so far in the fourth. Vanderbilt, the pass to Joseph. Memphis's ball. It just couldn't make the connection, but you appreciate their attempt at moving the ball. The Grizzlies shooting an even 50% since the fourth quarter got underway. 
Kennard outside. Vanderbilt with the block. Here's Joseph. Adams covering. Joseph passes to Reeves. Oh, Adams with the block. Oh, a fantastic defender. Adams embraces his role on this team as their defensive anchor. Pass to Robbie. There's a drive. And that one goes in as he's fouled. It'll be three points if he converts the free throw. Shooting from Memphis, Roddy at the line for one. Los Angeles has gotten six of 11 threes to go in this game. Here's Joseph, hounded by Moran. Joseph passes to Reddish. It's rebounded by Roddy. Roddy's got four rebounds now. Clark outside. Pass to Moran. That's his fourth foul. Missouri recognizes the situation because number five will put him in a rough, tough spot. First team foul. So it's the Lakers now. Here's Hayes. Here's Joseph. Outside Reddish. Oh, Adams with the block. And it goes out of bounds. That one off Adams. Here's Reddish. Just five to shoot. And after that fantastic first half, he's having trouble finding that shooting stroke. Goes back up. Ooh, plenty of contact on that shot. Officials call the foul, and he'll take two free throws now. Personal foul. Second team foul. At the line for two, Cameron Reddish. And he drops a first. That one falls, so he hits both of them. Of course, he didn't have an attempt there in the first half. He's hoping to be a little bit more active and aggressive here and draw some fouls here in the second. Now here's Moran. Here's Adams. And he banks in the layup. I love this game plan. That's 10 points in a row from in close. If you can't stop it, here it comes. I'm right at you. Here's Joseph. And the call is going to be, yes, an illegal screen. One of the trickier plays to judge, but it would be hard to argue against the call. Yeah, you know, the officials aren't nearly as lenient as they used to be on that call. As a matter of fact, I know I got away with a lot of those in my playing days, but that was 40 years ago. Now here's Moran. Vanderbilt pulls it in. Vanderbilt's got rebound number eight here already in the game. And Clark with a block. And that's out of bounds. The Lakers will retain possession. Outside Reddish. Pass to Hayes. 
Here's Reeves. Defended by Kennard. Clock is at three. Let's it fly. Well, I don't think he's performing up to his own expectations, but they still find themselves out in front. Morant with it. Morant missing again. I wonder if switching baskets really threw him off. I mean, because he can't get anything to fall this half. The Grizzlies have gotten seven of 16 attempts to drop since the start of the fourth. And he hits it and gets hacked. A three-point chance here if he can convert. He knew exactly where his man was going to be. Outstanding lead pass. Shooting for Memphis, Brandon Clark at the line for one. One shot. The free throw drops for Clark. Here's Joseph. Outside Reddish. And the shot goes in. Gotta fight hard to get over those screens. Well, I'm gonna credit the screen. I mean, that's a good, strong pick he lays there. Now here's Moran. Pass to Kennard. No one near him. And a great assist by Moran as that one goes. Moran's got his third assist of the night. You have to love the unselfishness on display there. Excellent pass. Here's Joseph. Up top for Reddish. Clark grabs the board. And the Grizzlies shooting 40% so far in this one. Moran against Hayes. And they blow the whistle just as he gets it off. That's two points with a chance at another one at the strike. Yeah, teams try to get physical with Moran, but he shows exceptional body control off the contact. The Grizzlies making a switch here. Tillman's checked in. Mind the lanes. Mind the lanes. One shot. The free throw drops for Moran. Here's Joseph. Pass to Reddish. Two minutes remain in this ball. Two and it's Tillman with a rebound. Tillman's got his eighth rebound here tonight. Now here's Moran. Back to Tillman. Shoots from the block. That one's wide left. A perfect example of how to protect the rim. And you know, guys, I love his fight and grit on the interior. I mean, he never lets a shot go uncontested. Now here's Reddish to the middle. Reeves the pass to Hayes. Hits the jump hook. The game two of the conference finals is always so important. What a great win this is for the Lakers. And you don't usually see this kind of blowout, but tonight they delivered the punishment. I mean, what's so impressive is they never wavered in their approach. They just kept at it and showed they were without a doubt the better team. Another statement win here in these conference finals. They look like they're in complete control and want to finish this series as quickly as possible. But at the same time, it's important that they don't get too ahead of themselves. We've seen teams come back from 2-0 deficits before, so it's important they maintain this momentum moving ahead. And when you look at the game, the one thing that helped fuel this team to victory was the efficiency for Anthony Davis. He played big all night, relentless on the glass, just helping his team in the possession battle. And Morant drops them both. Los Angeles has gone two of two from outside so far on the fourth. Here's Joseph. Outside Reddish. Tries to break his ice. Clark grabs the board. Well, the Grizzlies shooting an even 
50% since the fourth quarter got underway. And it's blocked. And out of bounds, Los Angeles will have it. Lakers ball. Miles Bridges checked in checked for Memphis. In for the Miles Bridges. They've got a commanding lead. It just seems like everything is going their way. Here's Reeves. Outside Vanderbilt. Five to shoot. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. That's on Brandon Clark. Man, the defender really went after him. Yeah, if you're going to foul, then make sure that you don't give a chance for the end one. Vanderbilt. Two shots. Free throw drops for Vanderbilt. Good on both. We've got 28 seconds left in the fourth. Outside Morant. Pass to Bridges. Here's Tillman. Five on the clock. Back to Bridges. From deep. That shot off the mark. So we see the Lakers taking the W here. And this win shows they have the momentum so far in this series. Up two games to none now. They just look so confident out there. They're playing selfless ball, and their chemistry has never looked better. All right, now let's check in with Ali LaForce. Ali, what do you have? LeBron, you've accomplished so much in this league. How have you been able to sustain it for so long? You know, it's only a select few. It's not many who make it to this point. And, and I would never take the game for granted. That's why I try to give everything I can till I can't give no more. And uh, I've been around some great players, great coaches, great organizations. And uh, for me to have this opportunity right here means a lot, and I'm very humble. Well, you're a sponge for knowledge, and you have a great work ethic, and it's been fun to watch. Thanks, LeBron. Thanks, Ali. Great interview once again. That concludes this broadcast of the Western Conference Finals. For Grant Hill, Clark Kellogg, and Ali LaForce, this is Brian Anderson thanking you for watching. We'll see you next time.